Today we are letting Imperialism decide the NFL's greatest team. Let me explain. What I'll be doing is spinning this wheel to pick a team, and then spinning this arrow to see which way they need to attack. So let's say this wheel lands on the Saints, and the arrow points north. The Saints will travel north until they reach the Chiefs. These two will play four one-minute quarters to battle it out. The winning team doesn't just take the land, but also the best player on the losing team. I will be repeating this process until one team rules them all. Did I mention that the field is going to shrink down to eventually a one-inch field as teams get eliminated? Well, it is. Now pick your team and cross your fingers because one-inch Madden Imperialism starts now. All right, here we go. We're spinning the wheel and we got the Cowgirls. All right. And the Cowboys will be attacking Northwest. Okay. It looks like the Cowboys will be invading Denver. Second and six. Denver already called a timeout. Another run play. Oh, my God. Pollard. Pollard and fumbles. Wow. And Denver picks it up. 38 seconds. Can Denver pull this off? Russell drops back. He throws it. It's caught. Wow, Jerry Judy. Denver actually might pull this off, all because Tony Pollard fumbled. Russell. It's bad. Oh, my God. Spin again. Who's it gonna be? It's gonna be the Niners. The Super Bowl favorites will be attacking north. The Niners will be traveling north to take on Seattle. What will they do here? It's so loud. Purdy feels the pressure. And he's sacked. Jake Moody. Here we go. The kick is up and it's good. Gino. He's gotta go deep here. Oh, he chooses to throw it. Are they gonna call a timeout? Are they open for the field goal, I guess? They're going for this. Five seconds. Chino going long here to the end zone. Oh my goodness. Oh, it's almost caught. There's a flag. Oh my God, it's P.I. They're gonna tie the game with a chip shot. Oh my God, they are going to OT. I think Seattle just won the toss. They've elected to receive. Second down, Chino again. He gets through. and we get to see the Cowboys play again. And they will be attacking West. It looks like the Cowboys will be attacking Arizona. 10 seconds left in the first half. Dak drops back. He's gonna run it. No, he doesn't. He finds Ferguson for the tutty. This is it, fourth and six. Kyler dropping back. All the time in the world. He scrambles. Oh, and it's incomplete, and the Cowboys will take the land and move on. The Cowboys get Buda Baker, and we will now see the Kansas City Chiefs, and they will be attacking south, which means Kansas City will be attacking the Cowboys. Dak Prescott, 56 seconds in the third. First and 10. If they're smart, they should drive. Sack drops back, feels the pressure, and he's sacked! Sack Prescott! Casey calls a timeout, only two left for the rest of the game. Dak drops back, and it's caught by CeeDee Lamb, and it's short of the first down, third and two. Another timeout from Kansas City. Third down, 48 seconds in the third. They run it with Pollard, and he gets the first down. And Kansas City calls their third and final timeout in the third quarter. All right, it looks like the Cowboys are going to run another play here. They do. Dak drops back, gets the first down. Brandon Cooks! The Cowboys are in victory formation. They'll kneel the ball, and that will do it. Dallas beats Kansas City. The Cowboys now with Patrick Mahomes, but first we will see the Cleveland Browns, and they will be attacking West, which means the Browns will be attacking Indy. This could be it. Lucas Oil Stadium's going crazy. Third and five, Flacco drops back to the end zone, and it's... Colts 
Let's receive Miles Garrett, and we will now see the Bengals take the field. And the Bengals will be attacking West, which means the Bengals will now be attacking Indy. Here we go, fourth quarter, midfield, one minute. Browning dropping back, throwing it deep to Jamar Chase. win the toss and elect to receive can the colts keep the drive alive Minshew is sacked by trey hendrickson five seconds left for jake browning i guess this is playoff ot and it's gonna go to a second ot jake browning drops back it's thrown into the end zone and goes to Cincinnati and we get to see the Seahawks and the Seahawks will be attacking East which means Seattle will travel all the way to Minnesota and take on the Vikings let's go two more plays to go 10 yards and a timeout you got Hawkinson and you got Justin Jefferson he drops back and he's sick 11 seconds and a miracle he drops back and he gets sacked again. Seattle takes all of the land. Getting closer and closer. Jefferson heads to Seattle and we get to see the Raiders. And the Raiders will be attacking West, which means the Raiders will now be attacking Seattle. Oh, baby. Feeling the pressure, he throws it, he's got an open man, it's caught! And a touchdown! Gino drops back, too much time, it's caught by DK, and he stuffs the man! No huddle, second and inches. Finally, they call the timeout. Pete Carroll may have just made the biggest, or second biggest mistake of his career. Gino dropping back, he has time, he throws it at... He could have simply ran it in, but he didn't. This might be ball game. Gino drops back, finds the open man, and he steps out. They got like two plays here. Gino drops back, finds the open man, and it's caught. A touchdown. They're going for two. Oh my God, this is game. Gino drops back, and it's caught again. Justin Jefferson will win it. Seattle gets Max Crosby. And we now get to watch the Commanders. They will be attacking West. You can hardly see them, but they will be traveling Southwest and facing the Carolina Panthers. Fourth and two, fourth quarter, 14 seconds remain. Bryce Young drops back, throws it, and it's incomplete. And that will do it. The Commanders will take the Panthers land. Derek Brown is heading to Washington and we get to see Seattle. They will be attacking South, which means Seattle will be attacking Dallas for all of this land. Let's go. Third and goal here. Just one yard. Mahomes finds CD Lamb and the Cowboys are the first on the board. One more first down and it's over. Mahomes drops back and it's thrown to CD Lamb and that should put the nail in the coffin and this will do it the Cowboys take all of Seattle's land Justin Jefferson will join the Cowboys and we get to see the Giants and they will be attacking East the Southeast, which means the Giants will be taking on the New York Jets. Here we go, the field goal. Greg the leg to send it to OT. Here we go, the kick is up and it's good! The Jets win the toss and elect to receive. One eternity later. In the fifth overtime, Greg Zerline for the field goal and the win. And it's good! The Jets beat the Giants! 
The Jets get Dexter Lawrence, and we get to see the Eagles now. And the Eagles will be attacking South, which means the Eagles will be invading Baltimore. Let's do it. 54 yards for Jake Elliott for the win. It's up. get Roquan Smith and we get to see the Packers now they will be attacking East which means the Packers will travel over water and face the Lions Jared Goff third and one 26 seconds three timeouts he throws it and it's caught in field goal range they call a timeout with 11 seconds here we go the snap the kick it is good! The Lions take the lead! Six to three with eight seconds left. Can he do anything? He drops back, launches it, and it's incomplete, and that's game. The Lions will take the Packers land. The Lions get Jair Alexander cornerback, and we see the Bears. And Chicago will be attacking north which means the bears will now be invading the lions 33 seconds now second and inches the lions hand it off he gets it and he lays down are they not going to kick this field goal they hand it off with five seconds four seconds they call the timeout to win the game the lions the kick is up and it's good get even better and pick up Jalen Johnson and we get to finally see the Patriots. They will be attacking Northwest, which means the Patriots will be attacking the New York Jets. Will the Patriots do something here? It's thrown perfectly and caught and he's in! New York's getting loud, almost at midfield, the 46 yard line. One timeout remaining. He drops back, he goes deep here. It's caught by Garrett Wilson. And they call a timeout. Zach Wilson, no timeouts. So much time. Finds the open receiver and he steps out. We'll probably get maybe one or two plays. Zach Wilson drops back, going for the end zone. And it's incomplete. The Patriots are two seconds away from claiming New York's land. Zach Wilson, the last ball. It's deep. And there's a flag. It's deep behind. Oh my God, the Patriots. The Jets will win the game. Oh my God, that's it. The Jets will take their best player and all of their land with it. The Jets receive Trent Brown from the Patriots and we get to see the Jets again. And the Jets will be attacking Northwest, which means the Jets will take on Buffalo. We're in overtime, and the Jets elect to receive 16 teams after this. 39 seconds left. Wilson drops back, finds Gary Wilson. Oh my God. The Jets are on the 30. A TD will win the game. Zach Wilson, Gary Wilson holds on to it. Second and goal. Zach Wilson drops back. End zone. And that's game. The Jets will move on and take Buffalo's land. The Jets got Stefan Diggs, and we get to see the Dolphins. And they will be attacking Northwest, which means our first 10 yard game will be the Dolphins attacking the Buccaneers. Every game from here on out is gonna be played on the commander's field because it's the only field that can show off the mod, okay? It's a tie game at 18, OT. Mayfield drops back. Oh, almost gets sacked. Does he get out of the end zone? He does, and he's dropped. There's a flag, face mask. That's not good. Oh my God, on the seven yard line now. Drops back. Oh, he gets brought down. Mayfield finds the end zone. He's incomplete. He's out of bounds. Can Tua take half of Florida and their best player, Raheem, powering through. What TD ends this game right now? Tua drops back. Looking at the end zone. And it's caught. Tyree Kill locks the game down. Half of Florida and Tampa Bay's best player. The Vince move on. The Dolphins 
Browns improve with a free safety, and we get to see the Jets. And the Jets will be attacking south, which means the Jets will be attacking Philadelphia. Let's do it. Philly gets the ball. They're up three. Jalen Hurts finds Swift, and he gets brought down for a safety. Third quarter. There's only been four seconds in the third. Zach Wilson. Scrambling, finds the open receiver. Will we see a handoff. We will, and he gets in. If they get this, it'll be a seven point game. Zach Wilson, not sure where to go and gets sacked. My man was staring at a MILF in the 300 section. The fourth quarter, the Eagles down by five. It's do or die. Jalen gets sacked for the safety. Zach Wilson with the ball now, hands it off to Hall, and he gets 10. Philly has two timeouts. They need to stop them here. They have to. Brees Hall drops a man, gets the first down. And that will be it. The Jets beat the Eagles. The Eagles are gone, and the Jets get A.J. Brown, and we finally see the Titans. They will be attacking southeast or west, southwest. That means the Titans will be traveling southwest and facing off against another team we haven't seen yet, the Saints. 12 seconds, one timeout, drops back. He's going for it, gets the first down, the ball their last time with six seconds. Only a couple plays, maybe two, maybe two. Finds the end zone, and it's almost picked off. Who's moving on? Who's taking the land of the best player? Tennessee, drop it back, end zone. Hail Mary, oh, and it's broken up, and New Orleans will take all of the land. Derrick Henry is now a New Orleans Saint, and we will finally see the tech and Houston will be attacking West, which means Houston will be attacking Dallas. Mahomes drops back, look at end zone again, and they get it! Jake Ferguson wide open! Mahomes, will he go end zone here? He doesn't. Oh, almost, finally, the second half. You have no idea, man. Please hand it off. Please, he doesn't. He throws it deep. It's caught by CeeDee Lamb. And he gets in for six. Fourth and 10, do we see the glitch here? Do we see it? We do. This is gonna be a <laughs> safety for Dallas. Dallas up by a lot and still throwing the ball. I, I don't get it. Will they get the first down here? They will, and some. Touchdown, Cowboys. Finally, the Cowboys. In Victory formation, the Cowboys will move on. The Cowboys get Tunsil, and we get to see the Jaguars. And they will be attacking Northwest, which means the Jags will be going to ATL and attacking the Falcons. It's 110 to 96, it's first and negative five. And he kneels the ball for a safety. The Falcons have a minute to score 12. Drops back, finds the open man, and he's in! Drake London! And that will do it. The Jags beat Atlanta. The Jags get their free safety, Jesse Bates, and we get to see the Jets. And they are attacking Southwest, which means the Jets will be taking on the Steelers. Let's go! The Jets are down by 36 to the Steelers. And I think the Steelers are gonna kneel it here, giving the Jets 62. That's gonna be it for the Jets. They're gonna try to get this, this playoff. It doesn't matter. They don't call a timeout. They finally do with one second left, and the Steelers, oh, they score. It doesn't matter. The Steelers win 96 to 70. AJ Brown joins the Steelers and we now see the Saints and the Saints will be attacking Southwest, which means the Saints will be attacking the Cowboys. Here we go. 16 point game, Derek Carr, third quarter. So much
much land for grabs. The play action of Camara goes deep and it's picked up and they nailed the ball. Mahomes drops back. He's going deep. Finds the open man and brought down. Mahomes, the handoff to Pollard and he's in. Minute left, Derek Carr has all day. Finds the open receiver, hikes the ball, drops back. Can he get a touchdown? He will! What a Goliath. They're probably gonna run the ball here. They will to Pollard, and he gets in! Oh no, he's short, third and goal. They're gonna kneel it, and that should be game, and it will be. The Cowboys beat the Saints in a nail-biter. Derrick Henry heads to the Cowboys, and we're one game away from a five-yard field, the Dolphins. They will be attacking West. So that means the Dolphins will be traveling West against Dallas. It's 70 to 70. Here we go. Tua needs to score here. Has to score here. He drops back. Look at end zone. He has a Jalen Waddle. 33 seconds remain. He was wide open. Cowboys taking over here. Mahomes. Play action, goes long here. Jake Ferguson again. Mahomes drops back, look at end zone. Oh my God, it's incomplete. Can the Miami defense hang on? Second and goal, Mahomes, look at end zone. And it's caught by Jake Ferguson. It could come down to this two point conversion. Mahomes, it's incomplete. He went for Jake Ferguson and didn't get it. And that will do it. Jefferson joins the Dolphins. The Cowboys threw like we knew they would. The Lions will be our first team on a five-yard field. They will be attacking Northeast, which means the Lions will be attacking Cincinnati. Five yards, let's go. It's 162 to 142. 34 seconds down by 20. They got to make moves here. What's going on? Browning backing up and it's caught for six. Fourth quarter, if Jared Goff scores here, the Lions, it's over. And there it is. The Lions will beat the Bengals. Miles Garrett joins Detroit, and we see the Dolphins. Oh my God. They will be attacking West, which means the Dolphins will finally invade LA. We have made it to the fourth quarter. Stafford, play action. Looking end zone, obviously incomplete. There's a flag, is it holding? Pass interference. 56 seconds, Stafford drops back. Looking end zone, fights Kyron. Miami probably gonna run the ball here. Wouldn't be surprised, they do. And Raheem is brought down a second timeout by the Rams. If Miami scores here, it's most likely over. Most likely. They hand it off to Raheem and he's brought down. 17 seconds, Stafford drops back. Going for the end zone, it's out of bounds. With three seconds left, Matthew Stafford, one second, time expires. It's caught by Cooper Cup. It does not matter though, Miami will move on. Aaron Donald joins the Dolphins and we see the Jags now. And they will be attacking Northeast, which means the Jaguars will be facing off against the Washington Commanders. Let's go. Last quarter for Sam Howell. Drops back. He's going to run it. He stops. Gets a touchdown. That was good. They need a turnover now. Big time. We're getting an onside kick here. It's up. And he's cracked for a safety. And just like that, Washington gets the ball back. 50 seconds, Sam Howell, all the time, starts to run, and he takes it in and gets stopped at the one. Fourth and goal, one yard, that's it. That's it, Sam Howell, dropping back, decides to run it in, he fumbles, and the Jags take possession. But they're gonna need it, it's gonna be a safety. Oh my God. <laughs> We're not going to see any field goals anymore. Sam Howell going end zone. And he gets in. Samuel for six. Trevor Lawrence down 
two. Snaps the ball, play action, and it's a touchdown! Just like that to Calvin Ridley! 27 seconds. He snaps the ball, looking end zone, and he's wide open again. What a back and forth this has been. 24 seconds. Here we go, finds the end zone, it's almost picked off! 15 seconds, third and goal. Two stops for Washington. Taylor runs it in! This might be the last play right here. Sam Howell drops back. Three seconds, two. Oh my God, it's almost picked and they have one second. One second, Sam Howell. Just needs six. And it's picked up! And Jacksonville hangs on! Scary Terry goes to Jacksonville and we see the Dolphins. They will attack south, which means if we go to the left here, we will finally see the Chargers. 238 to 198, Miami dominating San Diego, or they're the LA Chargers now, right? I don't know. Hikes the ball, goes to the end zone, and he's in for a touchdown! 33 seconds, hands the ball off to Raheem Mostert, and he's in! This game is over! The Dolphins take the Chargers land, finally! Four teams remain. Derwin James is now on the Dolphins. We now see the Lions, and they will be attacking South, which means the first game on the one-yard field will be the Lions versus the Dolphins. A minute left! We're tied at 822! What the hell? What's going on? Miami with one timeout. <laughs> Fourth and goal. Tua drops back, looking at zone. And it's gone. Justin Jefferson to give the Dolphins six. That's crazy. Goff gonna just he could just run it in. Throws it. What? Third and goal. Goff backs up. End zone. It's covered. Touchdown. Tua drops back, throws it. And it's a safety. The Lions might kneel the ball here. <laughs> And that's gonna give Miami two and the ball back. 26 seconds, second and goal. Tua drops back, looks end zone. He's gonna run it in. No, he throws it anyway. And it's caught by Tyreek Hill. And the Dolphins take the lead. 10 seconds left. This is absolutely insane. He drops back. And it's almost picked off. Oh my God. Second and goal. Seven seconds. That's so much time with this field. Tua drops back, looks end zone. And it's gone off the rebound. We gotta see this again. The throw, the tip, and the catch. My goodness, what a play. They need this to tie. This is big. Tua looking again for the tight end, and he catches it, and it's in. I'm afraid the Lions are gonna need the ball here. I don't think so. It's a tie game. Yeah, they're not. Four seconds. That's, that's enough time for two drives, honestly, if they score on this first one. Jared Goff for the end zone. It's almost picked off. Oh, my God. We might go to OT. Jared Goff has one second. Will we go to overtime at 900? Jared Goff drops back. End zone. And he catches it. That is game. The Lions win it. The Lions get Tyreek Hill. And we will see the Steelers. And they will be attacking South, which means the Steelers will be attacking the Jaguars and the Lions will move on to the finals. Let's go. It's 988 to 990 with 17 seconds left. It's first and negative 14. Pick it, end zone, touchdown. A booth review. Will it be upheld? I guess the TD didn't count. It was upheld. I don't know. I guess he was out. Pick it. End zone. It's going for a touchdown. Two-point conversion is massive right now. Huge. He drops back. He's going to run for it, and he gets it. Four seconds. Second and goal. Trevor Lawrence. He drops back. Looks end zone. And it's back.
wheels are set for the one inch field. It's the Lures versus the Lions. We're gonna spin the wheel and see who is attacking who. It's going to be the Steelers attacking the Lions. The winner of this wins it all. Let's do it. Here we go. First quarter, go. The Lions already pulling away, but the Lures come right back. I don't know how high the score is gonna get. First quarter, it's almost done. Three seconds, two seconds, and the Steelers are up by 24. Oh my goodness. This is just insane madness. The Steelers hit the 400 mark. The Lions following right behind them. Very close game. First half is over, and the Steelers are up by a ton. The Lions can't do anything. The Steelers get 700. They're up by like 40 points. Do the Lions have a chance? They're down by 40. Why are the Lions coming back? How are the Lions coming back right now? I don't even know what to say. It's a 30-point game with nine seconds. This is really scary, though, because you don't know what can happen with this much time. Pickett going for the two-point conversion. He gets it. This could be the longest nine seconds ever. Jared Goff, first and goal, drops back. Looking for the end zone. Out of bounds. And it's a safety. <laughs> I thought they were going to kneel it here. They run it, and Najee Harris runs it in, and it's a 40-point game. First and goal for Jared Goff. He drops back, looks end zone, and it's picked, and he kneels in. Mika Fitzpatrick ends the game. The Steelers take all the land and reign supreme. I can't believe it. Today we are letting Imperialism decide the NBA's greatest team. Let me explain. What I'll be doing is spinning this wheel to pick a team and then spinning this arrow to see which way they need to attack. So let's say this wheel lands on the Warriors and the arrow points northwest. The Warriors will travel northwest until they reach the Lakers and these two will battle it out where the first to score wins. The winning team doesn't just take the land but also the best player on the losing team. I will be repeating this process until one team rules them all. Now pick your team and cross your fingers because NBA 2K Imperialism starts now. We spin the wheel and up first is gonna be the Timberwolves. And they will be attacking Southwest, which means the Timberwolves will be attacking the Bucks. Let's go. Tip off. This means a lot because the first point wins and the Bucks get it. Lillard, quick pass to Beasley. Trying to get through. He does. It's gonna get blocked. He drops it. Oh, he misses. The rebound. Imagine they get Giannis. Come on, guys. We need one point here. Oh, my God. The tray. And misses. Rebound Giannis. Oh, oh. Stutter step. Oh, okay. On Conley, the mismatch. Finds Lillard for three. Misses. Oh, my gosh. Gobert. Covered by Brooke Lopez. Oh, my God. And drains it. Minnesota takes the best player. Milwaukee's land, and we spin again. The Wolves get Giannis, and up next is going to be the Raptors. And Glizzy, Drizzy, and company will be attacking West, which means Toronto will travel across water and head to Detroit. Don't get mad about where Toronto is on the map either, OK? I struggle with geography. OK, Detroit wins the tip. People are already counting the Pistons out. Don't do that. Kane Cunningham, the jump shot drains it. Detroit takes Toronto's land, gets their best player, and we spin again. Scotty Barnes goes to Detroit, and up next we see Wembenyama. And the Spurs will be attacking Northeast, which means San Antonio will be attacking Houston. Let's go. The Spurs are like my dark horse because Wemby should win every tip. He's a huge asset to any team, just like that. Wins the tip pump fakes another one right to the basket and just like that san antonio scores first takes down the rockets their land their best player and we spin again van fleet goes to san antonio and up next we see the spurs again and the spurs will be attacking west that means the spurs will skip to dallas and it will be a fight for texas let's go no matter what happens here if Wemby goes to dallas or Luca goes to San Antonio. It's going to be disgusting. Van Fleet, the new addition to San Antonio. The beautiful screen by Weminiyama. The pump fake to Wemby, the three. Oh, this is it. Kyrie has it back to green. And it misses. 
Webby with the rebound. He swings it. The jumper is in. The Spurs get Luka the land, and we spin again. The Spurs own Texas, and up next, we see the champions. And Denver will be attacking north, which means the Nuggets will be attacking the Timberwolves. A lot of land. Let's do it. The outcome of this game is wild because it's either Giannis or Jokic moving. Gobert wins the tip to Giannis. Already driving. Throws it out to Colin for three. He misses it. Oh, my God. Denver with the rebound. Jamal Murray for three. It's in. Giannis heads to Denver. They take all the land and we spin again. Giannis goes to Denver and the Nuggets are already favorites. Clippers next. And the Clippers will be attacking Northwest, which means the Clippers will be attacking the Kings. Let's do it. Will we light the beam? Sabonis wins the tip. Sabonis posting him up. The postman, the move. Oh, oh, he should have went up with it. He didn't. They have to, they have to fire this. He misses. Oh my goodness. Why didn't he go up with it? Okay, out to Paul George. In land. Subak wins it. We spin again. Fox heads to LA. And up next, we got the Grizzlies. And Memphis will be attacking Southwest, which means the Grizzlies will be heading to NOLA. Let's do it. At the time of me recording this, John Moran is injured. So a big disadvantage for Memphis. Valanchunas passes inside to Ingram. It's too easy. The Pelicans take the Grizzlies land, their best player, and we spin again. <laughs> Triple J is heading to New Orleans, and up next are the Miami Heat. And Miami will be attacking North, which means it's a fight for Florida. Miami will be attacking Orlando. Let's go. The Miami Heat are my favorite team, so I'm insanely biased. <laughs> Every time I go to a Heat game in Orlando against the Magic, the Heat lose. So I have a bad feeling about this. Hero to bam! Misses. This is what they do. <laughs> Passes it in to Suggs. Oh, and it's missed. Great D by Hero. Throws it down to Scary Terry. Drives foul. Our first free throw of imperialism. If he makes one, it's over. Are the Heat taking the best player the land and moving on? Scary Terry. Misses. <laughs> Can he make this second one? The first point. The free throw. It's in. And that will do it. Player and we spin again. Miami gets Banchero and up next star the Phoenix Suns and they will be attacking East, which means we have an insane matchup. Phoenix will be attacking San Antonio. Let's do it. Wemby wins the tip again. They have Luca Van Fleet gonna take the ISO, getting double team. It's ripped by Bradley Beal. He loses control here, but he's gonna take it to the basket. Passes out to Durant for three. It's in. Phoenix will take Luca all that land and will spin again. Luca goes to Phoenix, and the Suns are stacked up next. The Nuggets and the champions will be attacking East. This means the Nuggets will be traveling over the water to Detroit. Giannis and Jokic is like cheating they lose the tip though oh my goodness no shot he's gonna shoot this over jamal oh my god over Jokic. oh he misses the rebound by Giannis. oh god to Jokic. backs him down back to caldwell pope and that will do it denver takes detroit slam their best player and we spin again the pistons were who we thought they were and up next are the clippers and the clippers will be attacking north that means the clippers will be heading north to take on the trailblazers let's do it the east is just vibing bro okay the clippers have fox but the blazers win the tip as for the iso on fox the pick the screen takes it to the basket bro why'd he swing it out he has to he has to force this for three oh it goes in and the trailblazers take down the clippers Kawhi leonard is a trailblazer and up next are the suns they will be attacking west which means the suns will be attacking gold 
Golden State. If the Suns get Curry, I'm just ending the video, dude. Draymond wins the tip. Oh my goodness, no way. No way, they're running a play here. Makes a move on Booker, can't get through. Drops him, oh my God. The Warriors take the Suns land, their best player, and we spin again. Luka heads to Golden State. The backcourt's crazy, and up next are the Celtics. And Boston will be attacking Southwest, which means the Celtics will be attacking the Brooklyn Nets. Let's do it. Boston doesn't really need anyone from Brooklyn, so this is gonna be interesting if they win, but the Nets win the tip. No way, no way, no way. To Claxton! Oh, he misses! Rebound Porzingis! To Jalen Brown, to Tatum, for three? Oh, he misses! Claxton the rebound! Okay, what is going on? A lot of passing, I like the movement. Claxton, he has to toss it up, he chucks it up! Oh, almost over Porzingis! Rebound, Jalen Brown! Trying to make a move, the defense has been spectacular! And I jinxed it! And the Celtics will take Brooklyn's best player, their land, and will spin again! The map is shaping up. Who will be next? It's gonna be the Nuggets, dude! And Denver will be attacking Northeast! If you see this little spot in the Northeast, that is Denver when they beat Toronto, I believe. So that means Denver will be attacking the New York Knicks. The Knicks can do something crazy. There's so much land here. The team's stacked, but if the Knicks can get one defensive stop, it can make the difference. Giannis gonna take it, and that will do it. The Nuggets will get the best Knicks player in their little bit of land and will spin again. Jalen Brunson is now on the Nuggets, and up next are the Blazers. And Portland will be attacking Southwest, which means the Trailblazers will be taking on the LA Lakers. Let's do it. Don't forget that the Trailblazers have Kawhi Leonard. Portland wins the tip. They're looking for the three right now. Okay, he's gonna drive. He tosses it up. Oh, he misses. AD gets the rebound. Gives it to LeBron. LeBron at the basket. It's in. Kawhi Leonard joins the Lakers. They take the land and we spin again. The Lakers upgrade and we continue on with the Wizards. And the Wizards will be attacking South, which means Washington will be attacking the Hornets. Let's go. Okay, Washington wins the tip. Okay, to Kuzma getting guarded. Kuzma to the basket, throws it up. It's amazing. He gets his own rebound. This is again. Oh my goodness. Looking for that ISO. Makes a move at the three line. It's in. Charlotte makes the Wizards. Sinks their best player. They're landing. And we spin again. Kuzma sold, but he's now on the Hornets. And up next, the Thunder. And OKC will be attacking East. That means the Thunder will be attacking the Pelicans. A ton of land at stake. Let's do it. The Pelicans win the tip. CJ making his way. JJ. Misses! No way! That's a 14 second violation. Oh my god. Giddy makes it. And the Thunder will take the Pelicans' best player, all their land, and will spin again. Zion heads to OKC, and up next are the Nuggets. They've been getting so lucky, and they will be attacking East, which means Denver will be attacking Chicago. Let's do it. Denver could get DeMar DeRozan. Chicago wins the tip. Okay, White brings it down, getting covered by Jalen DeRozan on Giannis. Puts it up, gets blocked! Gonna control it here, already a mismatch. Brunson wide open for three! Misses! Here we go, Chicago taking it down now. Gives it to DeRozan for three! Oh, he misses! To Jamal Murray! Find the honest, and that will do it! Denver takes Chicago's land, their best player, and we spin again! The Nuggets get even more powerful, and up next are the Sixers. And Philadelphia will be attacking Northwest, which means the Sixers will be attacking Cleveland. Just like John Moran not being in the game because he's injured, Joel Embiid is injured at the moment. Cleveland with the ball first. Max Schroes, ex-Miami Heat player. Okay, the screen, Mobley. Backs up, drives, it's in! Cleveland beats Philly, takes their best player, their land, and we spin again. After
after this game, we will be at our final 10 and we get to see the Warriors. And Golden State will be attacking West, which means the Warriors will be attacking LA. Let's do it. The Lakers with Kawhi, the Warriors with Luka. This is an insane matchup. The Lakers win the tip and that could already just be the difference. LeBron to Russell misses Wiggins the rebound Wiggins to Luca trying to find his way Wiggins wide open for three connects the Warriors take the Lakers land their best player and we move on LeBron James joins Golden State and up next are the Celtics Boston will be attacking Southwest Boston will be heading to Cleveland to take on the Cavs let's go will Donovan Mitchell or Jason Tatum be on the move. Oh my goodness. Cleveland gets it. Looking for an open man. Mitchell! The jumper misses it, gets the rebound, puts it in! Cleveland takes down Boston! Tatum joins the Cavs, and up next are the Cavs. They will be attacking Southwest, which means we get to see the new Cavs take on OKC. Let's do it. The Hawks. The Pacers and the Jazz have done nothing in this video so far. But you never know what could happen with imperialism. Jason Tatum, Cleveland wins the tip. The pick, will he just shoot this? I think he will and he'll make it. And just like that, Cleveland takes the land and we spin again. SGA joins the Cavs. They have like the craziest border and we get to see the Hornets. And the Hornets will be attacking South, which means the Hornets will be traveling to Atlanta for the first time in this video. Let's do it. Atlanta's first appearance in the top 10. Charlotte, though, wins the tip, making a move on Trey Young, takes the screen. Oh my gosh, it was gorgeous, but he missed it. They push it. Atlanta's moving. Will he find Trey Young? No, he'll take it to the freaking open miss. Charlotte gets the rebound. LaBello throws it up, misses. Another rebound, ATL. Another rebound. Rebound Charlotte! Kuzma, the new addition! Will he make this? He doesn't! Rebound Atlanta! The screen is set. Caleb Martin on him. To Trey Young, guarded by LaMelo. Takes the screen, finds him at the basket, and that will do it! Atlanta will take Charlotte's best player. Their land and will spin again. The Pacers and Jazz are just chilling, and up next are the Nuggets again. And Denver will be attacking Southwest, which means Denver will be traveling to Utah, and we will finally see the Jazz play. Let's do it. If somehow Utah pulls this off, Giannis, Jokic, DeRozan, Brunson at the three line, wants the ISO. I think he's just gonna, I think he's gonna shoot this. Oh my God, it's too easy for him. He misses, Utah with the rebound to Markkinen. He sets the screen. Oh, DeRozan rips it. DeRozan to Giannis, to Brunson. This team is stacked. Oh my goodness, someone's open. DeRozan for three, misses, rebound Utah. Oh my God, back to Collins, to Markkinen. The play's moving to Collins. Covered by Giannis, he's gonna get blocked. He throws it up. Oh, he misses! Giannis the rebound! Oh my goodness! To DeRozan and DeRozan! Or is that Brunson? He misses! What is going on? This game is insane! The mismatch back to marketing. Done! Inside of Kessler! The mismatch! He misses! The screen from Giannis! Brunson to Murray! It's still 0-0! Jokic to Giannis! The mismatch back out. The three hits in. They take Utah's best player, their land, and we spin again. Denver is becoming an absolute Goliath, and up next are the Miami Heat. And Miami will be attacking Northwest, which means the Heat will be invading the Hawks. Let's go. I feel like Miami has some height on Atlanta, but Atlanta can shoot. They got LaMelo, they got Trey Young. Ah, uh, Johnson, Machero, Machero, the defense. Oh, the pump bank. Atlanta takes down the Heat, takes their best player, their land, and we spin again. We have five teams left. Jimmy Butler is an Atlanta Hawk. 
Mark, and we got the Cavs. And Cleveland will be attacking Northeast, which means we already get to see the New Hawks in action as Cleveland invades. Let's go. The Pacers are still just chilling. The Cavs versus the Hawks. Cleveland wins the tip. Tatum covered by Butler. We've seen this many times in real life. Tatum over Butler misses. Lamelo covered by Mitchell takes the screen. Lamelo back to Johnson. And he slams it off. And Atlanta will take Cleveland's best player. Their land and will spin again. ATL on top. Four teams remain, and we finally see the Pacers. And Indy will be attacking Southeast, which means Indy will be attacking Denver. <laughs> Let's do it. Pacers win the tip. Tyrese, can he do this? So much land. Their best player. No way. Back to Tyrese with eight seconds. Gonna take the screen. He's gonna take it to the house. Oh, he passes it out. Oh my goodness. No. Giannis to Murray now. Finish that Murray. He misses. Wait, who has it? Siakam. Finds Tyrese for three. Ah! And he will take all of Denver's land. The best player and we spin again. Three teams remain. Jokic goes to the Pacers, and we get to see Indy again. And they will be attacking East, which means the Warriors are going to the finals, and Indy will be attacking Atlanta. Let's do it. The Pacers are killers, dude. Who's facing the Warriors? Atlanta wins the tip, waiting for the play to unravel. He's going to take the screen here. Jokic on him now. Jokic gets passed up, and LaMelo takes it! And Atlanta will beat the Pacers, take Jokic, and move on to the finals! Ladies and gentlemen, this is it! The Warriors and the Hawks, who's winning it all at the finals? The first to score wins. Let's spin the wheel and see who is the home team and who's the away. Let's do it. Who's attacking who? The Warriors attacking the Hawks. Let's go. The Warriors with Luka, LeBron, Steph, the Hawks with Jokic, Jimmy Butler, Trey Young. First to score will win it. Oh boy, here we go. The tip. Atlanta gets it. This could be really quick. The pass to Trey Young, covered by Luka. Trey gonna take it. Oh, that will do it. Over Draymond Green. Atlanta takes all the land, and they are our first to score Imperialism champions. And the Curry for three. It's too late. Today we are letting Imperialism decide the greatest MLB team. Let me explain. What I'll be doing is spinning this wheel to pick a team and then spinning this arrow to see which way they need to attack. So let's say this wheel lands on the Mets and the arrow points northwest. The Mets will travel northwest until they reach the Yankees and these two will battle it out where the first to hit a home run wins. The winning team doesn't just take the land but also the home run leader on the losing team. I will be repeating this process until one franchise rules them all. Now pick your team and cross your fingers because MLB imperialism starts now. We spin the wheel and the First team is gonna be the Dodgers. And the Dodgers will be attacking South, which means it's going to be LA first. The Angels can Shohei take down his former team. Let's do it. Shohei Otani. The count is already one and two, like a statue. Okay, swung at that. It's a bloop, does it drop? It does, Shohei getting on with two outs. That was big. Now you have Will Smith. You may know him from I Am Legend, the hit movie Hitch. Coming in, ripped in. It's gonna drop. Doesn't matter what the score is. All that matters is that a home run is hit inside the park. Home runs do count as well, if it happens. Pitch coming in, swung on. That should, no way that's gone, right? Okay, warning track, and that's out number three. And I uh, has a chance now. Full count right now. Mickey in the box. Pitch coming in. Swung on, that's ripped. And the thing is back, back, and gone. And I beats LA. Take Shohei Otani. Their land and will spin again. Shohei goes back to Anna. Next, we're gonna see the Padres, and the Padres will be attacking 
north, which means the Padres are going to attack Anaheim, their new team with Shohei. Let's do it. If somehow Anaheim pulls this off, Padres are getting Machado. Ripped. No way. That's an out. That's out number one. Can you imagine how good the Angels could be? Tatis wearing the glasses. I love it. Pitch coming in from Shohei. Ripped left. Is that gonna go? The warning tracks. It's gone. And just like that. Again, and up next, we're gonna see the Padres. What is going on? And San Diego will be attacking Southeast. That means it's gonna be the Padres invading Arizona. Let's do it. Padres are stacked, dude. Slam Diego in full action right now. Pitch coming in. Ripped. It drops, doesn't matter. A chance for a double play, maybe, maybe. Shohei Otani <laughs> in the Padres uniform. He's gonna be moving all video long. Tatis, the one that recruited Shohei to San Diego. Can he do it again? The thing is ripped. Wasn't it? Was it gone? It was gone. And San Diego will take Arizona's land. The Padres get Christian Walker. And up next, we have the Athletics. And the A's will be attacking East, which means it's gonna be the Las Vegas A's versus the Rockies. Let's do it. I'm just, I'm just messing. The 2 1 pitch coming in, swung on, ripped. Can that be God? It's the back wall. That'll bring a run in, doesn't matter. Seth Brown now wanting to just finish this for Oakland. And that thing is God. Oakland takes Colorado's land and will spin again. Ryan McMahon goes to Oakland. Glenn and up next, we're gonna see the Padres. Oh boy. And the Padres will be attacking Northwest, which means it's gonna be San Diego versus Oakland. <laughs> let's do it. Now, listen, I'm not messing with any of the lineups. I'm letting the game auto reorder them. I don't wanna mess with anything and give anyone a disadvantage. But we got a 2 1 count now. Oakland has fans in their seats. Clearly a video game. Pitch coming in. Kim swinging at that 2 2 pitch. Coming in, swung on, long, deep center, two outs. And the new addition, Christian Walker from Arizona. Oh, baby, pitch coming in, and that swung on, and that should be the third out, and it will be. Okay, Oakland has a chance, but Shohei will be dealing. Pitch coming in, swung on, ripped, and we got one out. All right, Ryan McMahon taken from the Rockies. Rips that dead center, the warning track. We're gonna see the Rangers, the champs. And the Rangers will be attacking Southeast, which means it's gonna be the battle for Texas. The Rangers invade the Astros. Let's do it. The Rangers are attacking, so obviously they're batting first, trying to invade Houston. Who is taking control of Texas? Swag And up next, we have the Phillies, the Phillies, and the Phillies will be attacking South, which means if we go all the way zoomed in on the map, the Phillies are invading Baltimore. Let's do it. The Phillies batting first. Can we see a Schwarber bomb and just end this right here, right now? Pitch coming in, Schwarber ripping that, and we have an out, okay. Gunnar Henderson, the home run leader for Baltimore. Pitch coming in. Swung on, and that eggs ripped. Oh, it's foul. Never mind. No way. You can't give me that animation and be foul. Oh, he shreds that one down. Back. Oh, it drops off. Right over. Can he take down the Philly single? has been 
absolutely electric so far. Up next, the Athletics and our Goliath will be attacking North East, which means it's going to be Oakland invading Minnesota for a big chunk of land. Let's do it. Oh, baby. Shohei hasn't done much. He's just been traveling from team to team. Pitch comes in, ripped, and the commentator Jinx lives on. They take Minnesota's land, their best home run hitter, and we spin again. The Athletics get Max Kepler, and up next are the Blue Jays. Okay, and Toronto will be attacking Southeast. Now I know the location of the Blue Jays is absolutely wild. <laughs> But just live with it, okay? Toronto is invading the Red Sox. Let's do it. Vladdy, Geo Dillon ripped. Gets through, but it doesn't matter because all we want are home runs. Pitch comes in. Gets him straight three. The Red Sox have a chance. Rafi, full count, dialed in. Swings at that one, and that one's ripped. Probably going to hit the back wall. Oh, it goes over the green. to Boston and up next we're gonna see the Cincinnati Reds and the Reds will be attacking East which means it's gonna be Cincinnati versus the Nats let's do it I feel like the Reds have a better opportunity here I could be wrong that's swung on and that's two outs I'm probably gonna jinx it <laughs> Fitch comes in Spencer Steer and that is gonna be out number three all right Lane Thomas, the home run leader for Washington. Pitch coming in. Ooh, we add that 2-2. Hunter Green needs to get out of this for Cincinnati. The meaty part of the lineup is coming up. The meat. Pitch coming in, and that's going to drop. Ruiz, pitch comes in. Swung on, and that thing's ripped to right. The warning track, and it is gone. Washington takes down Cincinnati, and we spin again. Spencer Steer goes to Washington and up next, the Marlins, the fish. And the Marlins will be attacking Northeast, which means the Marlins will be heading to Tropicana Field and facing the Rays. Let's do it. The battle for Florida, Tim Anderson, the new addition in the offseason. Coming in, Tim smacking that one. Will it drop? It does. The fish are hitting right now. You do not want Jake Berger to step in that batter's box. I'm telling you right now. Okay, scooped up, and that'll be one out for Tampa. Berger bombs are on the menu. They're on the menu. Swung on, and Jake ripping that to right. Oh, it's robbed. Damn. I gotta, I gotta stay neutral. Okay, Jazz Chisholm, the X cover out. Pitch comes in, swung on, and that's going to be the third out, and the Rays are going to get a chance to hit. One-two count. Pitch comes in. And Jake Berger heads to Tampa. Well, that felt pretty realistic, and up next, we're going to see the White Sox. And the White Sox will be attacking West, which means it's going to be the White Sox invading St. Louis. Let's do it. Pitch coming in. And that is already ripped to left. And it hits the back wall. Oh my God. It was almost the first pitch. That can't be a good feeling for Sonny Gray. Pitch comes in, swung on. And that is out number two. Okay. Eloy Jimenez. Pitch swung on. We're going to see the Tigers. And Detroit will be attacking south. The arrow pointed a little bit more east and west, which means it's Detroit attacking Cleveland. Let's do it. Pitch coming in. And that should be out number two. It is. Kerry Carpenter. Can Cleveland get out of this? Oh, my goodness. That thing is absolutely ripped. God. And Jose Ramirez will join. Jose Ramirez goes to Detroit, and up next, we're going to see the Orioles. And 
Baltimore will be attacking South, which means it's going to be Baltimore invading the Nationals. Let's do it. Still a lot of teams we haven't seen play yet, so anything can happen at this point. Here we go. Pitch coming in. A gunner swing and a miss. Out number one. Here we go. The wind up. Pitch. Swung The Orioles, all right. And Baltimore now with Spencer Steer will be attacking West, which means it's gonna be Baltimore invading the Cubbies. Can Chicago do something here? Let's find out. The one-two count for possibly out number two. The pitch swung on, and we should see a double play here. Will they turn two? They wow! Pitch comes in, swung on, and that'll be out number one for the Orioles. Cody! Bellinger in the box. Swings at that. Oh, he was feeling antsy. Two outs. Oh, wait a minute. The throw at home. Oh, my God. Gets thrown out. Oh, no. Kyle Schwarber up. 2-2 two -two right now. Pitch comes in. Swing and a miss strike three. Spencer Steer. He's been moving around. And that is gone. We're going to see the Braves. And Atlanta will be attacking Northeast, which means it's going to be the Braves invading Baltimore. Several days later. Matt Olson in the fourth inning. Corbin Burns cooking. I'm dying. We have so much more to do. Oh, my God. He walked him. Ozuna. Please. to see the Yankees. And the Yankees will be attacking Southeast, which means it's gonna be the Yankees versus the Mets, the Subway Series. Let's do it. If the Mets win, they get Aaron Judge. If the Yankees win, they get Pete Alonso. That's why this is nuts. Pitch comes in, DJ taking that 2-2. The pitch, DJ, grounder, gonna get on. Aaron Judge, pitch comes in. Judge smokes that, and he'll get into play, two on, no out. Here we go, pitch coming in on Soto, it's fair. Torres, 1-1, one, one, two outs. The pitch, swung on, and City Field, and the Yankees will take the Mets lead, and will spin again. Pete Alonso is on the Yankees, and up next, we're gonna see the Rays. And Tampa will be attacking Northwest, which means it's going to be the Rays invading the Braves. Top of the second, not a home run in sight, but there's a K. 3-1 count, Strider delivers, and oh, another error. Pico, Strider trying to give the Braves another chance. Swung on, and they will have that other chance because that's out number three. Atlanta looking to take more land, expanding the empire. Ooh, what a grab for out one. Kyle Schwarber, the new addition to Atlanta. 2-1, one, one out pitch. Swings at that, and that's going to be another out for out number two. Oh my God. Sean Murphy. Rips that to left field, and that thing is gone. Atlanta with even more wheel of stage. Takes Tampa Bay's home run later, and we spin again. Bombs are now on the menu in Atlanta, and up next, finally, the Royals. And Kansas City will be attacking Southeast, which means it's going to be KC invading Atlanta. Hunter Retro, do it! Ah, oh, full count for Strider. Dude, the Braves, they make this thing last. Oh, it's ripped back and gone. KC upsets Atlanta, takes their best home run. Goes to Casey, an insane 
upset. We get to see them again. And the Royals will be attacking Northwest, which means it's going to be the Royals taking on the White Sox. The only team blocking them from the Oakland A's. Let's do it. Pitch swung on. And that's out number two. Okay. Matt Olson now the new addition. Dylan Dylan. Swung on. to 10 teams and up next the rangers and the champs will be attacking east which means we have yet another insane matchup the rangers are invading kansas city let's do it Jordan, though from the astros pitch coming in swung on the right and that thing's gonna be caught for round number three what's gonna happen here the pitch coming in swung on The one-two count with two outs. Can the Rangers get out of this? The pitch coming in. Luis gets it through. All these hits mean nothing because a home run is the... Oh, my. What a terrible call. A home run's the only thing that can allow you to move on. Marcus, he's the one that did it for them against the Astros. Can he do it? that we have yet to see. We, we, we get the Tigers now. And the Tigers will be attacking Northwest, which means the Tigers will travel Northwest to invade Milwaukee, who we haven't seen. Let's do it. The Brewers are pretty good, though. Willie Adams, Reese Hoskins, Christian Yelich. Will we see any of these guys? That thing's back and caught for out one. Jose Ramirez, the pitch coming in, swung on, and that one hit to left. can make an impact if they can move on right now. Out number three. Okay. Spencer Torkelson. He can do this. Let Tork hit with some torque. No homers yet in the second. Mm. Oh, Struck shoot. him out. These next two batters can make the difference for Milwaukee. Reese Hoskins out. Willie's about to rip this dude. Here comes. I told you. to Milwaukee and up next the Rangers if they go northwest it's gonna be the A's they're going north which means it's gonna be the Rangers attacking Milwaukee let's do it one eternity later we're in the final inning I think I only set it to, to six innings we haven't even gotten close to a home run yet whoever wins this game is moving on that's it two outs whatever the f happens right now that's it the pitch Yelich gets it through, and he got two on. Another pitcher in, 1-1. One, one. The fuck? Pitch comes in, swung on, and there we go. That's going to be out number three. It's either the game ends or a home run is hit. They got a runner on second. It's ripped, and gone. And that will do it. The Rangers beat the Brewers. Take their last. Spin again. Jose Ramirez goes to the Rangers. They're absolutely stacked. And finally, the Athletics. This could be a massive matchup. Oakland is attacking North, which means it's going to be the A's invading Seattle. This one's going to be crazy. Let's do it. Top of the third. No home runs yet. After this AB, Oakland has a real chance. We have been rolling. But the last couple games, they've been rough, dude. Castillo, the pitch. Swung on, and that would be out number one. We got some beef in this line. Oh, thing is no. foul. Otani, a statue. The pitch swung on, and that is an out. That's crazy. Do it, J-Rod! Oh. Oh. We need, like, a curveball right in the dick. Right there. That's what we needed, but not enough power because this center field is stupid. Seattle and up next are the Rangers.
Rangers. And the Rangers will be attacking East, which means for the first time in this video, we are going to see the Pirates because the Rangers are invading. Let's do it. If they somehow pull this off, dude, oh my goodness. I would be stunned. That's ripped and okay, it's the back wall. Ground rule double. The Rangers are loaded, but if they can get out of this, there's a chance. Oh my God. Okay, what a grab. We got one out on the board. Empty seats in Pittsburgh. Mid-season form. The pitch swung on, broken bat, and that is out number two. The pitch coming in. Gets him straight three. Brian Reynolds, the one-two pitch. Swung on and it gets through. Okay. Will he be Andrew McClutching? 2-1. Locked in. Pitch coming. Takes that. 3-2. Full count here with Sawinski. Captain Jack on deck. He's the one to do it for Pittsburgh. Andrew McClutching. Dead center. Got it. Did he get it? Pittsburgh takes down the Rangers. And we spin again. Madelson joins Pittsburgh. And up next are the Pirates again. And Pittsburgh will be attacking East, which means it's going to be Pittsburgh attacking the Yankees. A chance at Aaron Judge. Let's do it. Garrett Cole coming in. And that should be out number two, I believe. And it is. Matt Olson could be the guy to do it. Pitch coming in. Dude, that's bull that they're playing that sound. Pitch coming from Mitch. Ooh, got him. Strike three. The one two count. The pitch coming in. Got him. <laughs> Here comes Aaron Judge. It's a 3-1 count, I think, with Juan Soto on deck. Oh, my God. He just pitched that in the deck. Full count for Aaron Judge. Oh, walks him. Oh, my God. I forgot they have Pete Alonso. <laughs> oh, boy. Oh, my God. Can Mitch Keller get out of this? What a battle this has been. Got him. Strike three. Pitch comes in. O'Neal Cruz swings at that for some reason. That's out number one. Brian Reynolds swings. remaining up next are the Red Sox and Boston will be attacking West which means it's gonna be Boston invading Pittsburgh let's do it don't forget to have Vladdy on their team they got some studs that thing is ripped is that gonna be caught it is one out only four teams remain and the San Francisco Giants oh my goodness and the run is Judge is on the Red Sox and up next the Giants and for the first time in this video they will be attacking East which means San Fran will be attacking Seattle meaning Boston is going to the finals which team are they facing let's find out we're in the bottom of the four nothing no home runs they're up 2-0 it's through the gap can cool hand Luke send the Mariners to the finals oh, a full count The country is split. Seattle versus Boston. Who do you got? Leave it in the comments. Here we go. Who is attacking who? Seattle attacking Boston. Here we go. The final. You cannot blink. It could happen right now. Julio swinging at that. And we already have an out here, I think. What the heck is going on? One out already. The pitch swung on. And that thing is deep. Is that going to be it? It's the back wall. Ground rule double. Can show. Statue pitch coming. Got him. Two outs. Uh-oh. The newly acquired Jorge Soler from San Fran. The pitch swung on foul. The pitch swung on.
Imperialism decide the greatest three-point shooting franchise of all time? Let me explain. What I'll be doing is spinning this wheel to pick an all-time team and then spinning this arrow to see which way they need to attack. So let's say this wheel lands on the Lakers and the arrow points southeast. The Lakers will travel southeast until they reach the Suns and these two will battle it out where the first to hit a three wins. The winning team doesn't just take the land but also the best three-point shooter on the losing team. I will be repeating this process until one franchise rules them all. Now pick your team and cross your fingers because three-point imperialism starts now. We spin the wheel and up first we're gonna see the Wizards and the Wizards will be attacking south. That means we'll have the all-time Wizards attacking the all-time Hornets. The first to hit a three-pointer moves on. Let's do it. The Hornets have like Glenn Rice, Eddie Jones, Kemba, the Wizards, Bradley Beal, John Wall. Here we go. Glenn Rice, is he gonna pop this? He, oh, I thought it was about to. So does nothing. Another Miami Heat legend. That's a two. Doesn't matter. It means nothing. Bradley Beal can hit a three. John Wall. We're looking for one three-pointer. This team has shooters, bro. They have shooters. Okay, to Kemba. Are the Hornets gonna move on? Oh, Johnson for three. It did. Charlotte will take Washington's land. Their best three-point shooter and will spin again. The Hornets get Gilbert Arenas, and up next are gonna be the Cavs. And Cleveland will be attacking West, which means the Cavs will be attacking Indiana, who have Reggie Miller. Let's do it. Remember the best three-point shooter? We'll join the other team, Depot. Oh, Depot misses. Kyrie guarded by Reggie Miller. Back out to Price, into James. This means nothing. A two means nothing. Okay, passes out to Depot. Oh, he was there. He was there. PG number three. Paul George. And then Indy will take Cleveland. Their best three-point shooter. And will spin again. Kyrie joins Indy. And up next, we're going to see the Miami Heat. And Miami will be attacking North. Which means we have our battle for Florida. It's Miami versus the Magic. Let's do it. We need one three. Could it be Timmy? Could it be LeBron? The Magic also have Grant Hill who can pop threes. LeBron taking it to the rim. I feel like the Magic have the better starting lineup for this to happen. Dwight Howard for three. Can you imagine? <laughs> Penny looking for three. Penny Hardaway misses. There's got to be one. T-Mac. Okay. Oh, my. What? Oh, my God. From the logo, LeBron Wade wide open. Is Wade gonna pop this? He doesn't. To Tim Hardaway for three. Oh, misses. K to Penny. Oh, wait a minute. T Mac for three. It's in. The Magic will take the best three point shooter on the all time heat. Take the land. It will spin again. And up next, the Pelicans. And New Orleans is attacking North. That means it's gonna be New Orleans versus Memphis. Let's do it. Dude, these teams are awesome, bro. <laughs> I love it. Making a move. Conley, gonna dribble, gonna go for two here. Even if he makes it, it doesn't matter. He doesn't rebound. Jamal Mashburn, he would just pop this. He would, he would, he would. Oh, misses. Somebody, oh, wait a minute. Shot clock, shot clock. He's gonna have to shoot this, he does. Moran. Oh, misses. Okay, CP2. <laughs> Bro, ain't no way we're gonna get through the first quarter without a three-pointer, right? There's no shot. Back to Marcus all Conley wide open for three. This could go in. Oh, he misses it. It's a two. Oh, rebound. This is crazy. Ingram for three. Connect. And New Orleans will take the land. The best three-point shooter and will spin again. Mike. Miller joins the Pelicans and up next the Phoenix Suns and Phoenix will be attacking East which means we have the Suns invading the Mavs this one's gonna be crazy let's do it all right it's 6-6 six, six with three minutes left we've seen one attempt for three and it was a miss it was the first shot of the game by Steve Nash Dirk for three makes it the Mavs will take the land their best three-point shooter and will spin again. And up next, we are going to see the Pistons. And Detroit will be attacking Northwest. That means the Pistons will travel over the lake to Milwaukee. Let's do it. Now remember, when a team is up for the first time, it will be their starting lineup. But once they get a new player on their team, I will readjust their lineup for better shooters. Okay, O'Rob. Back and down, Thomas, outside. Ooh, misses. 
Rebounds. I think it gives teams advantages, which is cool. Some upsets, jumper, rebound. Instead of just like stacking these teams with just three-point shooters, it just it keeps it fresh in the first round. You know what I mean? No oh, one has shot a three yet. Okay. Johnson to Giannis for three. Oh, dang. <laughs> Ray Allen is at the scorer's table. Isaiah. Oh, I think Chauncey Billups is joining too. Oh, boy. Ray Allen is in the game. I don't think Chauncey Billups checked in. Ben Wallace, the screen. Back to Ben to the rack. Rebound. Bucks find Ray Allen. Ray Allen going to pop in. It's in. And that will do it. Milwaukee will take the lead three-point shooter and will spin again. Chauncey Phillips goes to Milwaukee and up next are the LA Lakers. And LA will be attacking Southeast, which means it'll be the Lakers and the Mavs. First to hit a three wins, let's do it. Now because Dallas already won a game, their lineup is now adjusted to be all three-point shooters. The Lakers at a disadvantage here, but can they pull this off? Can they play good defense? Defense. Can Kobe do something? Okay, Kobe. That Mamba mentality for three. Oh! Okay. To Shaq for three. <laughs> Kobe for three. Oh, he misses another one. Oh, 0 for two. They had their chances. Luca connects, and that will do it. Dallas will take the land. Their best three-point shooter, and will spin again. Jerry West goes to Dallas, and up next, we're going to see OKC. And the Thunder will be attacking East, which means the Thunder will be invading New Orleans. First to hit a three wins. Let's do it. Now, New Orleans might have their three-point roster here, but even without the Thunder winning a single game, their roster is stacked. Durant, Westbrook, Ray Allen. Oh, boy, wait a minute. Gordon for three. It doesn't even matter. The Pelicans take the land and will spin again. Ray Allen joins New Orleans. They're becoming crazy. And up next are the Clippers. Okay. And the Clippers will be attacking East, which means LA will be attacking Sacramento. Let's do it. The Clippers with the ball. Will we be lighting the beam in Sacramento? Or will the Clippers take this part of California? Just one time. I don't even think Ka Kawhi. Kawhi for three. Oh, he misses. It's 8-0 right now. The Clippers need a three. Will Kawhi pass it out to me? Does Chris Paul for three? Oh, he misses. Oh, my God. We might not see this happen. Richmond again, bro. Again. I don't think we're going to see one. Chris Paul for three. Did I jinx it? Another miss. Just pop this, Richmond. Pop it. Was that a three? Was it? It was. And that will do it. The Kings take down the Clippers. And will spin again. JJ Redick joins the Kings. And up next are the Kings, and Sacramento will be attacking North, which means the Kings will be attacking the Blazers, the Warriors, in this little island. <laughs> we'll see what happens, let's do it. This Kings team, because they won their first game, have their three-point only lineup in. But can Dame upset them? You don't know. Damian Lillard, oh my God, it could be right now. Oh my God, he misses. That was the chance. Back to Orob. Oh boy, Richmond misses. It's so weird to see. Oh my God, Brandon Roy. Oh, he misses. They're 0 for 3. So many opportunities to take a shooter. Can the Kings steal another stud? Can they? Orob for three. It's in. And the Kings will take the Blazers' land. Their best three-point shooter and will spin again. Dame goes to the Kings, but he'll ride the bench. They don't need him. And up next, the Raptors. And the Raptors will be attacking Southeast, which means it'll be Toronto invading Philly. All right, we haven't seen anything yet. It's 3-2. I think it's going to be Kyle Lowry. They really nerfed his ass in this game, most likely. Wait a minute. Kawhi for three. Oh, he misses. The second three attempted. The screen by Irving. Greer for three. Misses. Oh, my God. Vince Carter. Oh, I thought he was about to pop it. The lob. Oh, wow. This may be our first game that goes to the second quarter without a single three. Stoudemire, what is he doing? Bosh. Do it, Chris. Do it, Kawhi. DeRozan. Oh, my God. Get that shit out of here. It's 
inside the below. 15 seconds. Kawhi Leonard, please just don't. Just pop it for three. Penix, the Raptors take the Sixers land. And we spin again. The Sixers have been eliminated. And up next are going to be the Charlotte Hornets. And Charlotte will be attacking south, which means it's going to be Charlotte invading Atlanta, our previous imperialism video winner. Can they do it again? Let's find out. This Charlotte team is disgusting. <laughs> Okay, Trey Young with the ball again. 2-2. Two, two. It just takes 1-3. Trey getting guarded by Kemper. Oh my god, it could be this right here. That will do it! Atlanta takes down Charlotte! Are the Hawks gonna do it again? Up next, the Orlando Magic. And the 407 will be attacking East. I mean west <laughs> if you look down here by the florida panhandle it's gonna be the magic invading atlanta it's so tiny this is gonna be nuts let's do it oh my goodness trey young again for three does it go in it doesn't he misses oh boy to jameer nelson back to lewis to glenn rice oh he's trying to find that line oh you can't leave jameer open and the magic will take all the land from the We'll spin again. The Magic upgrade their Glenn Rice. And up next are the Pacers. And Indiana will be attacking West. That means the Pacers will be attacking Chicago. Let's do it. Pacers have Kyrie Irving, Reggie Miller, Danny Granger, Paul George. But we also have Derrick Rose and Michael Jordan on the Bulls. Scotty Pippen, he can shoot a three if he wanted to. To Paul George, Irving outside, but George takes Makes it misses. Derrick Rose the rebound. Prime D Rose. Six seconds on the shot clock. Gilmore. Four, three, two to Scotty Pippen for three. Makes it. The Bulls beat the Pacers. We'll take their best three point shooter, their land, and we'll spin again. I thought Steve Kerr would be on the all time Bulls, but he's not even in the game. Up next, the Kings. And the Kings will be attacking South, which means we are finally going to see the Warriors. The Kings are invading. Let's do it. Steph Curry, can he carry? Guarded by O Rob. They have KD as well for three already. Oh my God, he misses. Will Chamberlain the rebound? Rick Mary! Bang! The Warriors take the land. The best three-point shooter on the Kings, and we spin again. Peja goes to the Warriors, and this team is disgusting. Up next, the Magic. And Orlando will be attacking Northwest. That means the Magic will be invading the Pelicans. So much land at stake. Let's do it. The Magic win the tip. Okay. Oh my God, for three already, no way. Oh my God, he misses New Orleans. Oh my God, Mike Miller, corner three, misses. Rebound Orlando. <laughs> I love it. Glenn Rice for three, misses. Oh, it's going to get good. Covered by Lewis. Oh my God, Ray Allen, it's over. It's over. It's over. That will do it. New Orleans will take the magic land. Our best three-point shooter, and we'll spin again. Glenn Rice on the move again, and up next... We see the Nuggets for the first time. And Denver will be attacking South, which means the Nuggets will be attacking Dallas, a stack team versus a starting team. Let's do it. Melo can maybe do something. Jokic, Jerry West to Finland, to Steve Nash. This could be over quick, y'all. It could be over really quick. Dirk, the screen, Steve Nash, the trade. Dallas takes Denver's land, their best three-point shooter, and we spin again. Dallas takes nobody because no one would even start up next the timberwolves and minnesota will be attacking south that means minnesota will be invading milwaukee let's do it winters middleton chauncey billups who they grabbed from detroit the defense is there chauncey billups though ooh, closes them out sam cassell brings to the house rebound kevin love can this upset happen kg to the bucket gets the rebound hey hang on KG back out. Oh, he should have shot that. The screen. The three. Is it in? It is. And that will do it. Minnesota takes down the box and will spin again. The upset.
sets won't stop. Ray Allen on the move, and up next, the Spurs. We have yet to see the Spurs. Where are they going? Northwest. That means we have the Spurs invading Dallas. Let's do it. I, I don't see the Spurs winning this, but crazier things have happened. Jerry West driving the jumper. Misses Tim Duncan the rebound. Robinson, three seconds. No way. Tony Parker to end the Mavs. Oh, it's it. San Antonio takes their best three-point shooter all of their land, and we spin again. The Mavericks are done. Dirk goes to San Antonio, and up next are the Raptors. And Toronto will be attacking south, which means Toronto will be attacking New Orleans. An insane amount of land. Let's do it. This is the tip can mean everything. Stoudemire, no way, the three, is that it? Oh, he misses. New Orleans, the rebound. Glenn Rice to Ray Allen. Misses, rebound, Toronto, the three. Misses, oh man, it's all gonna be threes. Ray Allen to Rice, Ray Allen for three. Connects, Pelicans will take Toronto's land. The best three point shooter and will spin again. Officially 10 teams remain and five teams we haven't seen yet. The Warriors are up next and Golden State will be attacking East, which means it'll be the Warriors versus the Utah Jazz. Let's do it. I'm so nervous. It just takes one three. They got Pistol Pete, Carl Malone. Okay. Oh boy, that's it. Rebound by the Warriors. It could be it in a second. Curry trying to get around. Back out to Stasia. To Curry for three. Misses. Eaton is looking big, bro. Looking like he's eaten. Oh my God. No way. Pistol paint for three. Oh, he misses. Backing down John Stockton. Oh, he's dropping that. That's it. It's over. Oh, he missed. Eaton eating that rebound. The Warriors can't make anything right now. Oh my goodness. Carl Malone, he won't do it. He won't do it. Stockton for three. Wow, oh, misses! Rebound Peja! That could have taken down the Warriors! Falling inside, they don't need that! How is this still going on? Passes it out inside to Malone, misses rebound Peja out to Clay Thompson. They just need one three. Curry. Oh my god, inside again. What a pass. Not a single three, and there's almost a minute left. He can't do anything, bro. Curry again. Just shoot it. Just shoot it. Clay Thompson. That should do it. And it will. The Warriors take down the Jazz. I don't want you to stop watching this video, but I think the Warriors have it, especially with getting Pistol Pete. Up next, the Spurs. And San Antonio will be attacking. East. That means we finally get to see another team that hasn't played yet. The Spurs will be attacking Houston. Let's do it. The beard, here he goes. Prime Harden. Prime James Harden. On Tony Parker, back to T-Mac. T-Mac, Ginobili guarding him. Oh my God, will he do it? Oh, he missed it. Dude, one step back three from, from James Harden. It's over. That's how crazy this is. Up to Harden. Oh, they're gonna have to pop this. Wait a minute, we have a three here by T-Mac. Houston takes all of San Antonio's land and we spin again. The Elite Eight Dirk goes to Houston and up next for the first time in this video, the New York Knicks. And the Knicks will be attacking Southwest, which means we have New York attacking Brooklyn, meaning the Celtics are the last team that have not gone yet. Let's do it. The Knicks taking the ball down 4-0, not even a three-point attempt yet. Frazier, oh man, this game, this game shouldn't go past the first quarter. It shouldn't. It might. Come on, do it. Do it, Mello. Do it, Mello. What, what's, what is the play right here, boys? The heck? Pop that Mello for three. Bang! It goes in. And the Knicks will take Brooklyn's land. And we're down to seven. And up next, we're going to see the Timberwolves. And Minnesota will be attacking Southeast, which means the Timberwolves are attacking Chicago. Let's go. The Bulls get the ball first. We're in Chicago. Reggie Miller, Zach Levine, BJ Armstrong. And just like that, the Bulls take down Minnesota. And we spin again. This Chicago Bulls team with Ray Allen now is disgusting. Up next, Warriors. And Golden State will be attacking East, which means it's gonna be the Warriors versus the Rockets. A lot of land for the West Coast. Let's do it. This tip means everything. Peja versus Dirk, who's winning it? It's going to Houston. Oh my goodness, this could be the end right now. 
McGrady, guarded by Pistol Pete. Oh my God, just like that could be over. And the Rockets take down the Warriors. Five teams remain, and do we see the Knicks finally? We do. We've already seen the Knicks. I meant the Celtics, and the Knicks are attacking Southwest, which means it's going to be the Knicks versus the Pelicans. Boston still has not played yet. Let's do it. New York wins the tip. Melo guarded by Peja. It could be quick. Okay, Vince Carter on him, the new addition to New Orleans. Double team, that's risky as hell. Allen Houston. Oh, he misses. Peja, the screen. Mike Miller takes it. Back to Peja for three. Misses. If the Knicks pull this off, it's a damn heist. Okay, Melo to the basket on Peja. No one on the offense moving. Finally, they do, and... And he misses, gets his own rebound. Melo now, the jumper connects. He'll never miss that. Okay, back to Vince Carter. Oh, the jumper. What the hell? They are now down a three-point shooter. Oh, my goodness. For three. Kevin! The Knicks take all of New Orleans land. And we spin again. Four teams remain. And we finally see the Celtics. And Boston will be attacking Southwest, but more West. That means we have Boston invading New York for all of this land. Let's do it. Larry Bird has a crazy tendency in this game to just chuck up threes. Boston has been hanging on, bro. Bird tosses it up, misses, rebound, New York. New York's team is stacked. They have Ray Allen on their squad now. You don't know what could happen. This team can pop threes. Starks just like that, misses. Ooh, just has to find Larry Bird and he'll throw it up, I'm telling you. Larry Bird for three. Oh, he misses! Allen Houston, the rebound! To Ray Allen, that's gonna do it. Boston's going! Misses! Oh, Pierce, the rebound! <laughs> he's crazy in this game. I don't know what he is. Uh, he's rabid for three! Makes it! And that will do it! Boston takes all of New York's land and will spin again! Boston has two Ray Allens and a bird, and we're gonna see them again. And the Celtics will be attacking south which means boston will be attacking houston and no matter what chicago is going to the finals let's do it don't forget that houston has steph curry and james harden boston has two ray allens and a bird steph curry guarded by ray allen dirk oh my god harden's wide open larry bird can't stick with him but that might make him drive a little bit little jumper misses rebound taking it down now larry bird ray allen i don't know which one the old one. Oh my god, for three. Connect! Boston takes down Houston. They'll get Steph Curry and they'll face Chicago in the finals. Ladies and gentlemen, we have ourselves a classic. Boston versus Chicago. We'll spin the wheel to see who has home court advantage. Let's do it. It's gonna happen quick. We spun the wheel and we're in Chicago. Don't blink. Who's winning? Oh my god, Chicago with the tip. Chicago wins the tip. Can Michael Jordan end this? BJ Armstrong guarded by Curry. Okay. Still guarded by Curry. Back out to Hyren. Oh, he misses. Rebound Boston. Oh, no. Kosi to Ray Allen. Is he going to shoot this? He doesn't. Back out to Curry. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. The other Ray Allen. Oh, and that will do it. Boston takes down Chicago. map are 18 of the best teams at Madden 24. But by the end of this video, only one team will rule them all. Let me explain. What I'll be doing is spinning this wheel to pick a team and spinning this arrow to see which way they need to attack. So let's say the wheel lands on the Dolphins in the arrow points west. That means Miami will travel to Cincinnati where they will battle it out in four one minute quarters. Not only will the winner take the land, but the best player on the other team. And to add some chaos, the field will get skinnier and skinnier as more teams are eliminated. Now, Pick your team and cross your fingers because skinny field imperialism starts now. And our first team is going to be the Sea Chickens, okay? And Seattle will be attacking South. And from the jump, we have Seattle invading the Chiefs. Let's go. Now for the first eight games, our teams will be playing on a field where out of bounds doesn't exist. Seven seconds for Geno Smith. What's his plan? He snaps it. He's looking. Look it. Throws it. Enzo. It's caught. DK. 
for six. 27 seconds left in the third. Mahomes driving, driving, hands it off. Play fake, looking, throws it downfield. It's caught. Right down at the 25 yard line. Tari having a game. 50 seconds, second and one. Mahomes dropping back, looking. It's caught. End zone. Touchdown, KC. 37 seconds. Gino dropping back, looking downfield. It's caught by Metcalf, and he's going to 10. Five touchdown. What a throw by Gino Smith. Seattle takes the lead. Two more chances for Mahomes. Third and 10. Six seconds. Snaps it. Looking, looking, throws it. It's caught. What a grab. And goal for Seattle. Will they score here on their drive? Gino to Metcalf. Today! Seattle goes up, and the Chiefs have one chance. The Chiefs could go for two to end the game if they score here. KC throwing it. Oh, he's out of bounds and running. And he'll score. <laughs> out of bounds does not exist. It's a tie game. I thought he missed that. I think they're learning that out of doesn't exist. Gino throwing it deep to DK. He gets it, and it is gone. What a game he's having. And I think that's it. Is it over? That's the end of the game. I have no idea how NFL playoff rules work, but Seattle will win it. Take their best player, their land, and will spin again. Patrick Mahomes goes to Seattle, and up next, we see the Cowgirls. And the Cowboys will be attacking Southeast, which means Dallas will be attacking Tampa Bay. Let's go. Pollard in the backfield. Dak hands it off to him, and he gets rocked. 36 seconds at the 42-yard line. Mayfield hands it off. White is going. The 20. Wow! That's going to do it, I think. And this for the ball game. The land and their best player. The kick, it's up and good. All right, Dallas has eight seconds to do something here. Eight seconds. Looks like he's going to run it. Oh, my goodness. Gets brought down with four seconds. Dak has four seconds. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. Dak dropping back. Looking, waiting, waiting, chucks it. Out of bounds, doesn't exist, so it's caught. <laughs> He's brought down, and that will do it. Tampa takes the best player, takes the lead, and we spin again. The Cowboys choked, and Parsons is off to Tampa Bay, and up next are the Jags. And the Jaguars will be attacking north. Duval will be attacking north. Buffalo, let's go! Second and seven at the 28-yard line. 30 seconds left in the first. Josh Allen looking, almost picked off! Wow, third and seven! Oh boy, third and seven, a huge stop for Jacksonville. Play action, Josh Allen running backwards, throws it long, it's out of bounds, but it's Stephon Diggs with the catch! Allen snapping it, hands it off to James Cook! Breaks through! Jacksonville will get ball at half, but will Buffalo score here? They will. Too easy for Stephon Diggs, untouched. Oh my God, 29 seconds, first and 10. T-Law dropping, looking, gonna run it. Oh my gosh, he gets sacked. A 10 yard loss. They take a timeout with 24 seconds. Trevor Lawrence snapping it, looking, throws it. It's caught! What a grab! They tie the game! Is it too much time for Josh Allen, though? It might be 20 seconds is a lot for the game. The kick, it's up! And no good! <laughs> Trevor Lawrence looking deep. Three seconds, launches it downfield. It's in the end zone, and there's P.I. Is it D.P.I.? It is! By Tamar Hamlin! And the Jags are gonna win it! With a chip shot! The kick is up! And good! Jacksonville will win it! Take their best player! And the land, it will spin again!
Stefan Diggs goes to Jacksonville, and up next are the Seahawks again. And they will be attacking Southeast, which means Patty Mahomes will be traveling to LA. Let's go! Huge stop. Will Stafford snap it? He will. Drop him back and looking. Down the middle of the field. It's caught! Oh, go! A 33 yard game! They're like me after three scotches. Stafford fights. Caught! Touchdown! No huddle. 36 seconds. They got to move. Three timeouts. Mahomes all day. Does a spin. Looking. Caught. In the out of bounds. And he's rocked. He's still up. Still up. 27 seconds. <laughs> Three timeouts. Mahomes dropping back. Looking at so loud and so high. Almost picked. Second and 10. Mahomes has 11 seconds. Third and seven. He's dropping back. He has all day. Looks. It's caught and he gets in. What a throw. And they're going for two in the game. Oh my goodness. Mahomes looking. It's caught. And he gets in! And that might do it! What a call! LA has six seconds. They're gonna run this. He gets brought down with three seconds left. I think this is it. Stafford looking, dropping way back, throwing up the hill. Mary gets rocked! And that will do it! Seattle will move on! Take Aaron Donald all the land and will spin again! The Seahawks continue to upgrade, and up next are the Texans. And Houston will be attacking West. CJ Stroud will take on San Francisco. Let's do it. I have no idea who they would get if they win. The handoff to McCaffrey, and he's gone. The 40! He's brought down. First down. Wow. Snaps it. Has McCaffrey, drops it, and Jennings again! First down! What a game he's having! All right, here we go. Second and ten at the one. They got McCaffrey. Why not? Throwing it. Game it oh! Touchdown! Second half. It's CJ Stroud's turn. Play fake. Already looking. It's incomplete. Broken up. He got dropped. Stroud snapping at first and ten. Look in middle. Houston, what can they do? CJ Stroud looking, going at zone! It's batted away! What defense! This is game right now, third and ten! This is it! Stroud looking at zone, he has to! It's good! They score! And we're going on OT if he makes this! The kick is up! And good! Wow! CJ Stroud hands it off again, he gets dropped. and Houston gets another try. The kick is up and good. A tie game and they get a touchdown. It's over. I don't get how playoffs, playoff overtime works. Is the game over? It's over. Oh my God, finally. The Niners go down. The Texans take their best player all their land and we spin finally. CMC heads to Houston and up next we see the Saints and the Saints will be attacking West, which means New Orleans will be attacking the Cheeseheads. Let's do it. Jordan Love ready. Drops back, hands it off, play fake, looking, throws it. Guy runs out of bounds. He's still going. It's brought down. <laughs> Damn, he's in the bleachers. The Packers want to score here. New Orleans gets ball at half. The Packers want to score here. Aaron Jones oh, oh making God. a move under the back. Oh, my God. Joe Jones, he's dancing on him. 18 seconds. Big first and goal at the six-yard line. Jordan Love looking. It's caught. Second and goal. Huge drive here for the Packers. Oh, no. Third and goal. They're 
kicking the field goal. Gonna rely on the defense in the second half. The kick, it's up. Good. Derek Carr has one minute to score a touchdown and win it. The screen to Kamara. The block is perfect. He brings it to the outside. He's going. The 50. He's still off by the trash can. It gets brought down. First and 10. Are they going for six or they just want to bring this thing into OT? First and 10. Derek Carr dropping back. Look at end zone. Oh, he's It counts because out of bounds doesn't count. Oh, my God. A booth review. What happens here? It's upheld. It's a touchdown. <laughs> oh, my God. This is probably the last play of the game. They're going to go end zone here, I think. Jordan Love looking, rolling out, still looking, throws it out of bounds with four seconds. This is it. This is ball game right here. Third and five. Jordan Love looking, fires it, end zone! Incomplete! And that will do it! The Saints beat the Packers, take their best player in their land, and will spin again. Twelve teams remain, which means the field is shrinking and up next will be the new saints who have jair alexander and they will be attacking northwest which means the saints are headed to houston let's go 36 seconds they gotta push it houston also gets ball at half Caught again first down dude this texans are legit 15 seconds one timeout Stroud snapping it, looking, end zone, looking, gonna run it, and he slides, he got scared, six seconds, they're gonna kick the field goal here and get the three yards, the kick up, and good, Houston also gets ball in half, probably gonna hand it off, he does, no play fake, looking, cut, he dropped it, it's fourth and one, they got a punt, what a stop. Is he going to take this? He is. Went straight up. <laughs> Only one timeout for New Orleans with a minute left. The final quarter. Derek Carr dropping back. Finds the open receiver. He finds the lead. Oh, my God. 36-yard lead. To tie the game and bring it into overtime. The kick. It's up. And good. Houston's moving, getting sacked. He, oh my God, he got it off. Wow, second and ten. I can't believe it. That would have been a huge loss. Shroud hands it off to McCaffrey. Picks up about four, 36. Are they going to score here? Shroud looking, scrambling, still looking, throws it out of bounds. Oh my gosh. Here it comes to take the lead. The Saints will get a chance still after this. The kick is up. Oh my goodness, a stop here would be amazing for the Texans. What will New Orleans do? Derek Carr chucks it out. Oh, this is it. If they don't convert, it's over. And Houston wins. Derek Carr trying to keep the dream alive. Chucks it downfield deep. It's gone. Houston, they will get another chance. If Houston just scores a field goal. If Houston gets a field goal, it's over. What a story this has been for the Texans. Stroud, look at it. It's caught by Singletary, and he's dropped. If Houston makes this, he's still a player. The land and move on. The kick is up. to Houston that team gets even better and up next are the Tampa Bay Bucks and the Bucks will be attacking north which means Tampa Bay will be attacking Detroit let's go oh the play fake looking looking throws it out of bounds starting for field goal probably coming all right a field goal to take the lead the kick up and good Lions will get ball at half Let's see what they can do. Here we go, first and 10. Jared Goff looking to put six on the board. Has all day, finally fires it out of bounds. Second and 10. What is going 
going on right now. <laughs> there is no offense. Zero. Change my mind. It's do or die right now. They need this. Oh my God, he should have handed it off. He can run it. He can run it. What is Scott doing? He has all day. All day. Throws it deep in the end zone. It's caught. Touchdown, Detroit. Baker Mayfield has 10 seconds, three timeouts, and a dream. Snaps it. Looking downfield. Throws it. It's caught. Here we go, five seconds, second and one. Baker, drop it back, throw it in long. There's a flag, it's caught by Mike Evans. Holding, oh no, they will do it. The Lions will take the best player of the land and will spin again. Ten teams remain, Parsons joins Detroit and we get to see the Lions again. And the will be attacking Northeast. That means Detroit will be attacking Seattle for a lot of land. Let's go. Mahomes can't get into field goal range. Having a terrible day. He snaps it. Scrambling again. He throws it. It's caught. Brought down another timeout. One left. Third and 12. Dude, if they don't get this here, they may punt the ball to Detroit. And they're going to have a chance. Mahomes launches it, it's caught, DK Metcalf! To take the lead with a field goal. The snap, the kick, it's up, and it's good. He's gonna run it out, and that will do it. Seattle takes on the land, we spin again. Seattle is stacked and owned the middle of the island, and up next are the Ravens. And Baltimore will be attacking East, which means Baltimore is hungry and it's bird versus bird for a lot of land. Let's do it. All right, we're in overtime. Just a boring game. The handoff and he's dropped for seven yards. Both teams will have a drive if they don't score or they get the same amount of points. Justin Tucker is huge for Seattle because the skinny field is all about field goals. We see the Jags now. Duvall will be attacking East, which means if Jacksonville wants a piece of Seattle, they got to get rid of Pittsburgh first. Let's do it. Second half, the Lurs on the field now. Rudolph going deep. <laughs> Third and four. Rudolph throws it. It's caught by Rudolph. And he's having a seizure. Rudolph wants this. They don't get it. Jackson. Wait, wait, what? What just happened? What just happened? Can Pittsburgh keep the pressure on? Trevor Lawrence scrambling. He's gonna run it! Oh. And gets all oh my god! He tricks him! Taylor looking, throws it, it's caught! Touchdown, Jacks! And here we go for the game! The kick, it's up! And it's oh. Jacksonville stays alive! Takes their best player and we spin again! TJ Watt moves on from the Lurs. One more game, and we move on to the skinniest field, the Dolphins. And Miami will be attacking Northwest. Dolphins will be attacking the Bengals. Got to push it. Browning dropping. Finds the open receiver. Ten seconds. I, I think it's over. I think he's going to go end zone. A fake spike. Oh, he throws it. Incomplete. Four, four seconds. From the parking lot. 
What? Are you gonna be kidding me? The kick is up! Oh, it dikes! That won't do it! The Dolphins move on, take the land, their best player, and we spin again! Jamar Chase joins Miami, we go to the skinniest field, and we see the Dolphins! And Miami will be attacking Northwest, which means the Dolphins will be attacking Seattle. A lot of land at stake! The skinny field, let's do it! We're most likely gonna see a punt to a no, no idea what to do. He's <laughs> gonna get lucky. Tua hands it off, Mostert! Okay, nice run, man, fourth and 11. We're gonna sim the game. It looks like Seattle is just kicking field goals. 12-0, okay, Dolphins scored 12. No way. The Dolphins win 15-12. They take all the land, their best player, and we spin again. I thought that game was over and I blew it. We're, we get to see the Jags now. Mahomes is on Miami. And the Jaguars will be attacking Northwest, which means for the first time in this video, we get to see the Cleveland Browns. Let's do it. Here we go, Duvall and Cleveland. The handoff. Okay, that's about three yards. Second and seven, Trevor Lawrence hands it off again to ETN. Gets another three yards. Here we go, we're simming the game. All right, second quarter, Jacksonville scores. Can Cleveland score? They do. Jacksonville scores again. Cleveland scores. It's a tie game. Jacksonville goes up by three. Oh my goodness, it's 21-17. 23-21, going into the fourth quarter. Here we go. This is the last chance for Joe Flacco. Fourth and 10. Oh, incomplete. Jags are in victory formation. They'll take Miles Garrett and we'll move on. Ladies and gentlemen, our final four up next, the Texans. And they will be attacking Southwest. We have a massive matchup against the Dolphins for a lot of land. Let's do it. Drops back, play fake, looking deep, maybe. Gonna run it, throws it deep. All right, we're in the second half. We're gonna simulate the third quarter. Okay, the Texans score seven. Dolphins score seven. Texans, nothing. Fourth quarter, here we go. Come on. My goodness. The fourth quarter, first and 10. They're on the 10-yard line. What a play by Houston. I think when it's simulating, it's not taking account of how small the field is this way. <laughs> Third and 18, baby. And this field goal will give Houston the lead and the win. The snap, the kick, it's up. And gone. The Texans will take the land. Miami's best player and will spin again. Tyreek Hill joins Houston and we finally see the Eagles. Their first matchup in the tournament they will be attacking Southwest, which means Philly will be attacking Duval, and the Houston Texans will go to the finals. Let's see who they face. Let's go. All right, y'all, Philly versus the Jags. We're gonna sim to the fourth quarter. Here we go. All right, so far, Jacksonville scores seven. Okay, first quarter's done. Jacksonville's up 7-0. Next quarter, can Philly retaliate? Okay, Jacksonville goes up. 14-10, 21-10, third quarter. Okay, here we go. 13-21, 28-13. Oh boy. Fourth quarter, the Eagles are down. And that's what happens. What the? Okay. That's what happens when you don't attack. You don't have the players like these other teams do. Second and 10, can Philly score here? He throws it incomplete. Third and 10. Okay, Jalen. Philly with no timeouts. If they do not convert here, it is over. Oh, okay. What a throw. And Jacksonville in victory formation. Taylor will kneel it. They'll take Philly's land. Their best player in our finals are set or is set. Whatever, let's do it. Here we go, our finale, the Jags versus the Texans. Home field advantage means nothing because we have to play on the 49ers stadium anyway. We're gonna play this one out from start to finish. Who do you got? Lock it in, let's do it. It's raining in our finale. Texans versus the Jags. The Texans have Tyreek Hill, Miles Garrett, the Jags, I don't even know, they have some studs too, bro. These teams are loaded. All right, this field goal is gonna put the Texans on top if it goes in and it does! 
Houston up by three, okay. Fourth and 17. This is ball game, I think. T-Law throwing it downfield and swatted and almost picked. And CJ Stroud takes it and he's in victory formation. And I think that will do it. And CJ Stroud will take his final knee. And the Houston Texans are our four-yard skinny field imperialism champions. Kind of an unfortunate finish because, like, what do you expect the other teams to do? That mod is trash because they just step out of bounds. <laughs>